Hi children, welcome back to English class. I'm Sabida Joseph, your English teacher. First of all, I wish you a very happy new year. We are in the year 2021. I wish you all the success and prosperity in this year. Okay, so let's come back to the class. Children, last day we learned a lesson that is lesson 2 from your English literature textbook. What is the title of the story? Yes, the four strings band. So children, that lesson is related to music and we got a message. What's that? That we should love and respect our grandparents like what Ria did in the lesson. We learned such a lesson in the first semester that is lesson one. Do you remember the story? How old is Mutaji? Yes, in that lesson we saw how Putta and Putti they worked hard to find out Mutaji's age. When Mutaji know that she is 100 years old, she became very happy. Just like that, in this lesson, Ria, she plays music and she formed the music band. When she played music, her grandmother is very much happy. Grandparents are a gift to a family. I hope all you have grandparents. I am also blessed with grandparents because their love is unconditional. Their love will always stay with us wherever we go. This is the main theme of this lesson, the four strings band. Okay, children, now all of you take your textbook, page number 17, lesson 2, the four strings band. Okay, now I'll read and explain. Grandmother is unwell and all the money that Rhea and her mother had saved up in a box has already been spent on medicines. Let us read about how Rhea finds a way to help the family. So, Rhea and her mother, they kept a money box. And if now there is no money in that money box, which is already spent for grandma's medicines and treatment. So they are uh, very sad. That is how to collect money for grandmother's treatment. So here we got the characters, grandmother, that is Ria's grandmother, Ria's mother and Ria. Okay, let's continue. Grandma liked it when my friends Sarah, Arshi and Harsh came home with me because we played music for her. Sarah played the bongo drums, Harsh played the flute, Arshi played the guitar and I played my violin. So here we can see Ria's friends. What is their names? They are Sarah. She played bongo drums. What is bongo drum? Bongo drums, a pair of small drums played with fingers. Okay, in this image you saw bongo drums. So Sarah played bongo drums and the next friend is Harsh. He played flute. And the next friend is Arshi. She played guitar. And our main character Ria, she played violin. So grandmother liked when Sarah, Harsh, Arshi, they came home and they played music. So grandmother liked that music. Next page, page number 18. Then grandma fell sick and couldn't even leave her room. I wondered when she would be able to step out again. The whole house seemed so empty and quiet. Here we can see after some days, Ria's grandma fell sick. She became bedridden. She couldn't leave her room. So Ria was so sad. Next paragraph. One day, as I was playing my violin, I remembered the stories my mother had told me about grandma and her love of music. When grandma was a little girl, she used to play the violin too. She would play at parties so that everyone could dance and sing. She was so good at it that when people went home, they would leave money on the table for her. Then what happened? One day Ria was playing her violin. We know Ria is a violinist. That time she remembered the stories told by her mother about grandma. What was the story? When grandma was a little girl, she used to play violin at parties. That time people would come for the parties, they would dance, they would sing and they would leave some money for grandma at the end of the party. Okay, that thought or that idea struck into our Ria's mind. That is how she decided to form the music band and collect money for grandma's treatment. So here we can see Ria got this talent that is playing violin from her grandma. 
बिकॉज ग्रैंड माई इज ऑल्सो वाइल्डनेस वेन शी वॉज द लिटिल गर्ल ओके देन लेट सी वॉट विल हैपन दैट्स वेन आई हैड एन आइडिया आई कुड हेल्प फिल अप द मनी बॉक्स अगेन आई रैन टू ग्रैंड मास रूम ग्रैंड मा आई विस्पर्ड इज दैट यू रिया शी एंसर्ड इन ए स्लीपी वॉइस I was just having such a nice dream about you. Come and sit with me. So when Ria remembered all these stories, she wanted to discuss her idea with Grandma. So she ran to Grandma's room. So when she reached the room, she asked, "Grandma, are you there?" So Grandma said, "Is that Ria?" Ria come inside I was having such a nice dream about you she said in a sleepy voice she was sleeping and she was so much tired so grandma she was talking in a sleepy voice let me brush your hair grandma i brushed grandma's hair and told her my idea children did you brush your grandma's hair before here we can see our riya she brush her grandma's hair we know grandma is bedridden she is not well so here here riya helps her grandma to comb her hair so this is also an another message given by riya and then riya discussed her idea with grandma then she thought it was a great idea but tell me the truth grandma i asked her Do you think we can really do that? Of course you can. No question at all. She answered smiling. Go ahead and ask your friends right away. And that was how the four strings band was formed. So Ria discussed her idea with her grandma. And she thought it was a great idea but Ria asked again. Grandma can we do that? Is that a good thing? That time Ria's grandmother replied of course you can do that no question at all she replied with, with a pleasant voice okay so uh, Ria's grandma was telling that you discuss this matter with your friends go ahead and ask your friends right away so what do you mean by right away right away means immediately so riya's grandmother was saying you can do that that's great thing you go and discuss with your friends immediately okay so this is how this four strings band formed first riya got an idea about this band then she discussed her idea with her grandma with grandma's permission and support she started this four strings band okay now let us see how she earned money through this band okay next page page number 19 Our music teacher helped us choose music that we would Our music teacher helped us choose music that we could all play together. My aunt who plays the guitar helped us practice. After many practice sessions, everyone said that we sounded very good. Ma and grandma said that anyone would be glad to have us play for them. So their music teacher help them to find the best music which they can play all together okay then here we can see our riya's aunt she played guitar so riya's aunt also helped them to practice after many practice sessions they well set they are able to play music in programs okay let us see the next paragraph it was sara's mother who gave us our first job She asked us to play at a party for Sara's great grandparents. It was the 50th anniversary of the day they had opened their bakery on our street. So they got the first program. So it was Sara's mother who gave them the first chance to perform for the party of their great grandparents because it was the 50th anniversary of their bakery. Okay, all of Sara's aunts, uncles and cousins came to the party. Lots of people from our neighborhood also came. Ma and aunt walked down with grandma slowly. It was grandma's first day out in a long time. So it was the day of the program. So all of Sara's uh, relatives, cousins, everybody came for the party. Not only the relatives, the neighbors also came for the party. So it is grandma's first day after a long time because she was bedridden. So she came to the party with the help of ma and aunt. Okay, so everybody is there. 
Let's see the next paragraph. Sara, Harsh, Arshi and I waited in one corner as people took their seats. We all had our instruments ready. Sara's mother asked us to step forward. She introduced us to everybody. Please welcome the Four Strings Band. She announced before giving the stage to us. So, our four friends, Sara, Harsh, Arshi and Ria, they were waiting in a corner of the stage. So, that time everybody seated. All the guests, they were seated. At that time, Sara's mom came to the stage and she invited everyone and she welcomed this four strings band onto the stage. It felt like a school assembly. Everyone there was looking at us. But we just stood there and stared right back. We couldn't find the courage to begin. Then I heard my grandma whisper, Play Ria, just like you play for me. I nodded and tucked my violin under my chin. Arshi held her guitar in position. Hush put his flute to his mouth. Sara held up her drums. After that, we played and played. We made mistakes, but we played like real band. One by one, everyone got up and started dancing. So they felt it was just like a school assembly because everybody was looking at them. They got scared. They became nervous. So they stared them back. Okay. Then they couldn't get the courage to start the program. That time Ria heard her grandma's voice. Grandma was saying there uh, from the audience, she was saying, Play Ria, play just like you play for me. Okay. So when Ria got that encouragement from her grandma, she took the violin and here you can see the word tucked my violin under my chin. What do you mean by tucked? It means put something into a small space to hide it or keep it safe. Then they start to play the music. When the audience heard the music, they started to dance because they were playing such a nice music. They played like real band. Everybody liked that. Okay. Ma and aunt smiled at us every time they danced by. Grandma nodded her head with the beats. Sara, Arshi, Harsh and I forgot about being scared. We loved the sound of the four strings band. So uh, from the audience, Ma and uh, aunt they were dancing there okay we can see the grandma she was nodding her head with the beats of the music everybody gathered there was dancing they forgot about that they are being scared okay they enjoyed the music then afterwards everybody clapped and shouted sarah's great grandparents thanked us for making their party memorable late night sarah's mother told us what a great job we had done and gave us an envelope with our money in it. So after the party, everybody clapped and everybody appreciated them. Uh, Sarah's great grandparents, they were also happy. They thanked them for making that day more memorable. What do you mean by memorable? Memorable means something that people will remember. Okay, then after the party, Sarah's mother gave them an envelope with the money in it. So that is the first amount they collected from the four strings band. Okay, last paragraph. As soon as we got home, we settled down to divide the money. We made four equal shares. I climbed up and put my share right into the big money box on the shelf. That night, I slept with a smile on my lips. So when they reached home, they divided that money into four equal shares. What do you mean by share? Share means parts of portions. Okay. So whatever they got, they, they divided that money into four equal shares. And Rhea put her share into that big money box. And that night, she slept with a smile on her face. She was so happy that uh, she could... Uh, fill the money box again and uh, we know that she loved her family very much instead of demanding anything she realized her family problems and she finds the way to help her family okay so that is what Ria had done so she was very happy about it and that's why she slept with a smile on her lips Okay, she could help her family financially by doing something she loved. She loved to play music. Then by doing that, she could help 
her family so that is why she is so happy and that night she slept with a smile on her lips okay so that is the beautiful story of riya the four strings band okay children so here we can see riya is very kind and compassionate child and we can also see the unconditional love of grandma and we can see how grandma and uh, riya's mom riya's aunt sara's mom and the audience everybody encouraged uh, this four children okay with their encouragement they could achieve the success especially grandma she encourages riya to make the four strings band with her friends and make her believe in her own abilities okay children i hope you all loved this story and i hope you all understood so everybody should read the textbook and next day we'll discuss the question answers until then take care and bye